That's right, ladies and gentlemen. It's uh, what? It's Monday afternoon. <laughs> yeah. It's the Little Old Sons podcast uh, coming to you live. Not live. This is pre-recorded. I'm sorry. I'm Donnie Daytona. With me is Carlos De La Cruz. The Carlos De La Cruz. Kevin Wayne. The Kevin Wayne Reed Jr. Jr. I always forget the Jr. I did too. <laughs> And Carson, it's me. It's me, Carson. Carson. Carson, Carson. who? Carson Sanders. Any of you guys know this guy? Mm. Yeah, I do. Really? Anyways, <laughs> <laughs> we um we talk about <laughs> Tony lost it. This is Carson. <laughs> I don't remember. Dude, he's been here oh, for crazy. like seven it's months. The glasses. Oh, oh, it's the mustache. It's oh. the mustache. He has a mustache. <laughs> <gasps> I don't. That, that, was, that was his I finger. don't see it. Let me borrow your glasses. Don, it's me, Donnie. I guess that is hair on your lip. I thought it was just. I thought you just it was dirty. Or had something. a dirty. dirty Rub it a little. Oh no! <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, I knocked the lenses out the other day. Did I? When you hit me in the face with that? I don't remember. Uh, that. I don't remember that never happened. Well, it did. What do we talk about? I think we talk a little bit about pooping. Um, um, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah we talk about pooping. Talk yeah, about bathroom pooping. stories. Yeah, detention. accidents, wow. detention, crime, sports. Yeah, I got arrested. Carson's yeah. bull riding. Oh, we did talk about that. Yeah. Bull riding, yeah. entering yeah. his first, first rodeo event. First yep. open bull riding. And bull riding. Bull riding. Ride boat. Going to a bull riding. Bucking moose. Bucking moose. All right. Talk about then, recovery. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Slumps. Oh, slumps. Them holes. Them highs, them lows. Digging them holes. Yep. Not them hoes. Them holes. <laughs> and, um, that really uh, yeah. kind of just it. sums it up, yeah. you know? It's, uh, it, 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 it's, a it's all over the place, yeah. you know? It's just a really good show. You're yeah. not going to want to miss it. Like it's I said, one for the fans. Like I said, the Carlos de La Cruz, mm. de La Cruz, mm. the Kevin Wayne Jr. Jr. Yep. And, tell him. Tell him. Carson this, Michael. This is my buddy no. Carson. You look like a Michael. You look like no, someone. No, I don't. You don't. Oh, yeah. You, look you like know what you look like? Don't. You look like an Oscar. You look like my what? eye doctor. What? You got a, you got a good looking eye doctor, huh? Uh, Anyways. Uh, talk to him about that. Uh, <laughs> enjoy the podcast. It's one you're not going to want to miss, people. Thanks for watching. Are you ready? Yeah. It's the Little Old Sons Podcast. Little Old Sons little. Podcast. Yeah. <laughs> oh. <laughs> we, we have no agenda today and no. nothing to talk about. So who knows? This is oh, great. Oh, jeez. Oh, yeah. <clears throat> How's everybody doing today? Wonderful, Donnie Daytona. Ditto. 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 Yeah. Fantastic. Carlos. Fantastic. I have not done a lick of work today. <laughs> Uh-oh. Oh, so what's new? I'm just kidding. Uh-oh. I'm just kidding. Dad. I'm glad we're all on the same page. Dad. <laughs> oh, shoot. <clears throat> How's life? What's, um... How's that rodeo you just went to? Good. Uh, let's not... We're going to talk about... <laughs> we're going to talk about the rodeo that you guys are going to this oh, weekend. On Saturday? Yeah. Yeah, I'm trying to get entered in a WPBRO. It's a deal where you can pick they have three pools of bulls it's low mediums and highs so and but it's all for the same like you're all entered in the same deal yeah i understand how it works i know i'm just trying to explain it for the (laughs) listener okay but yeah so i'm gonna enter in that it's in corsicana we're gonna do corsicana of course you can't (laughs) (laughs) but yeah i'm gonna do the mediums how do you feel I'm nervous. <laughs> Can you do one in the, like, level one and one in the level two, or are you stuck in the mediums? Do you only uh, get one bull? I'm pretty sure. Yeah, I think you only get one bull. Yeah. Oh. I thought Willie got on two that day. No. 
No. They ran that bull twice. I think they ran him like three times. Really? Yeah. What do you yeah. mean? What do you mean you're trying to get entered? Well, yeah. Yeah. So Joe like sent me a number and told me to text him. And then it was over the weekend, so I texted him and it had been two days and I hadn't heard anything back. And then I told Joe and so she messages the guy and like within seconds the dots pop up of him typing. <laughs> And I guess he just hadn't checked his messages because it was over people the People want to talk to her. They don't want to talk to you. Yeah. I had to get some pool. I, I didn't really know what to say either, so I just said, hey, Hi. I'd like to enter in the Hi. WPBRO in Corsicana, I low to mediums. To My come name get is on Carson. Your <laughs> <laughs> I heard you guys had some bulls. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm a fan of Dale Brisby. <laughs> I get one. I, I, I get two. <laughs> <laughs> I get one. When are you coming back? We'll find out the 23rd. I go see the doctor. Yeah. Again. <laughs> Once again. When did you break it? It feels like a year ago now. Yeah. Because I broke it, and then I got on, like, what, maybe 20 head, and then redid it. Yeah. Was that this year? Yeah. I think it was, like, it was hoodie weather. What are you doing? I like it the other way better. Oh. <laughs> this is better. Oh, no. Don't break my mic stand. It's fine, Donnie. <laughs> <laughs> what about you? When are you back? I'm shooting for August, but I can't even walk on it. So. Does it we'll still see. hurt? Yeah, it hurts. Like, I don't. I've tried it where I throw the crutches away. I'm like, I can walk. And then I'm like, stepping on it, and I just. No, fall down. Nah. <laughs> <laughs> and then, yeah. You got on Boone the other day. I got on Boone, yeah. Yeah, your boot didn't fit in the stirrup. But now I can take my boot off because it doesn't hurt anymore. So nice. I can wear a normal boot. So Nice. There's that. How often do they have those WBROs or whatever? The there's one like every weekend. Yeah, I think there's one. Every other weekend. Why aren't y'all trying to enter? We're in? Sweet. Woo! Enter them every weekend. I'm planning to now. Yeah. Well, Dale, yeah. Yeah, well, now, yeah. Is that all you have to say about that? That's all I have to say about that. <laughs> right on. Right what on. else were you expecting? Buddy? I don't know. Are you excited? Like, yeah, like, like how do you feel? Yeah, I'm excited. Because I, I know how I felt. I'm like, I feel like I'm going to get there and just, my, I, I feel like I'm going to get there and I'm scared that I'm just going to be like, Lost. No. <laughs> no. You'll be <laughs> all right. right to do. Yeah, you got it. But I'm really excited, but I'm nervous. Plus, you're not going somewhere, and you're, like, the only person. Like, you, you know people there. Like, we're going to be there, and you're just not driving two hours for nothing. I won't be there. Sick. You entered somewhere else? Yeah. I just don't. Ooh. Man, I don't know if I want to go anymore. Shut <laughs> <up>. <laughs> <laughs> it's fun, though. Going yeah. like just like around Texas, even it's it's fun. I'm excited because like I've been here for like seven months now. I'm finally starting to feel like I'm getting better, and like this is just like another step. It's like another wall or whatever. Yeah. yeah. And you yeah. meet I don't know you meet a lot more people going places. Yeah. And make connections, and then. You might find a whole different crew that you're like, oh, I want to travel with these guys. Yeah, these guys are way cooler. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but you don't even travel with the crew, and you don't travel with us. <laughs> you guys don't go anywhere. I know. <laughs> <laughs> you guys, Tony, they're going to the open bull riding. <laughs> yeah, Donnie, you go yeah, Donnie. <laughs> <laughs> crack out, crack back out, oh, Donnie. Crack back okay. Out, okay. You get on lows. Oh, in my in the bull riding. Yeah, yeah. I could. Oh. Uh-oh. But I'd have to buy my permit. Oh, yeah. Did what? you buy your... Uh, did you buy? have to buy a permit? Do you have to buy a card? Do you have to... I'm buy, I'll buy my permit there. Ah. It'll be like 100 plus the permit. So it'll be like 125. Dang. Big money. But if I win... <laughs> <laughs> Even bigger money. I have yet to cover a bull at the house. <laughs> <laughs> but if, dude, you're gonna cover this. You're gonna cover them. I like, wouldn't be surprised if you go the there game. and get on something that's easier to ride than what we got at the house. 
Yeah. Willie was saying that he wishes he could have that when he got on back because it was less we, than what we, we had. We all wish we could have Yeah, back. I mean, you always do. <laughs> but, yeah. like, he Man, was saying. I wish I could have yeah, that, that one. Yeah, that shit's sale. That's gone. But, like, <laughs> he said one. that one that he got on was less than these that we had yeah. at the house. I know what you mean. Yeah. But, anyways. Where how's, are you? How's Go. fishing? Got a, you got your bass boat? Yeah, I got my boat back, and... I think Donnie thinks that I'm done bull riding because I have another thing to do. Because <laughs> he made a comment today. <laughs> Uh-oh. So here's the thing. So Donnie <laughs> likes to take little shots at my confidence. <laughs> I don't take shots at your <laughs> Not confidence. My conf- I don't know how to put it. As but as he knows that he can get through to me. <laughs> and he does. <laughs> I've never said anything about your bull riding. <laughs> no, you say, no, Donnie? you definitely don't with my bull riding. Like, that's different. But, like, whenever I was about to take that. <laughs> loader off the trailer <laughs> he knew that he could get to me and he did <laughs> i said are you sure you should be doing this or something like that i don't yeah. even remember but i was like <laughs> and on the inside i was like am i <laughs> i've ran on so many times <laughs> but, oh, uh, that's funny yeah you guys can join in in the yeah. conversation <laughs> Kevin, you're usually the one that carries these. I normally do, like, just murder these podcasts. <laughs> but. <laughs> but when it comes to, like, rodeoing, I don't, like, or riding bulls or anything. Yeah, like the serious stuff. I don't I don't joke around about that stuff. No. Because I know how hard it can be to climb, <laughs> yeah. climb out of those holes. Yeah. <laughs> and they get deep. And... There's times where it seems like no one's on your side. <laughs> <laughs> and it gets depressing. So I don't mess with a guy about that kind yeah. of stuff. That's horrible. Have you been in a slump? Or are you in a slump right now? I don't think I've ever been out of a slump. <laughs> <laughs> horrible. I'm just slump daddy over here. <laughs> slump oh, daddy. Slumpville. Oh, they man. only, I don't know, the peaks get higher, but the holes get lower. I guess. I don't really know. I've just been in a big hole. And there's been times where like, like oh, I could, I might could get out of this hole. <laughs> oh, yeah, there's times yeah. where you're climbing, you're climbing, and you're like, oh, I'm about to punch through this ceiling, and you get uh-huh. right there, and you just free fall back. Yeah, the then ground. prison mic throws you into <laughs> yeah. the fence. And yeah, you're brought back down. I wasn't speaking about him specifically. Oh, I am. But then you're back in Dandy. <laughs> yep. Yep. It's worse. <laughs> But you gotta like spend money to fix oh, your car man. so you can get to Dallas to see the doctor. <laughs> <laughs> You're like, man, I hope my car makes it. <laughs> I think it's all part of it. I'll let you guys know. <laughs> <laughs> it's not too bad of a time. No, I'm having fun for sure. Yeah, like, for sure. I think these will be the times we talk about. Uh-huh. I think. I think. I, that's Maybe. what we keep telling ourselves. So. No, man, this is a good time. Yeah. We're in it. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> Maybe. Oh, shoot. oh, oh man. We were kind of talking about that on that podcast yesterday. And um, we were talking about um, Rusty Wright posted something. You're right where younger you saw yourself or something like that. Yeah. yeah. Keep on going. <laughs> <laughs> Just keep Ooh. on trucking. So That's all you can do. We'll see. Yeah, yeah. man. Because <laughs> life's a joke. We're just in a good bit. That's right. Ha. 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 I think if, uh, it wouldn't be fun if you're just, just good. Like just if, if you just got on and you were just good. Man, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> no. If you didn't have to work for it, it definitely wouldn't be as rewarding. Yeah, and you've never worked for anything. So yeah, and I'm just good. At so stuff. this is really just a punch in the teeth for you. <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry, because I've never been good at anything I've ever tried to oh, do. Yeah, ever. I've just been like the av- I've always just been the average. Or like, I mean, I've been really bad at stuff, but like, pretty much just the average. I think the only thing I was like okay at. Was playing football and I was just okay. <laughs> like good. Yeah. I was terrible at baseball. I was terrible 
Well, I didn't. I was terrible at basketball, but I didn't play basketball through high school. That was just something I did through middle school. Mm -hmm. You ever been terrible at something? Yeah, skateboarding. But I wasn't the worst. But I just had trouble learning tricks. I just, I don't know. The falls just hurt. You have to fall to get good at that. And pavement hurts. Yeah, concrete is an unforgiving surface. Yeah. I never even tried. I had yeah. a skateboard. I would sit down on it and ride it down my driveway. <laughs> I had a big long paved driveway. I would uh, ride it down. Uh, that's smart. And I, I Closer down, to the concrete. I went yeah. down to it now. I smacked <laughs> my head off the asphalt one day. And I was like, I don't want to do this anymore. I had a SpongeBob skateboard and I lived out in the country and like there was just yeah. no pavement. So I would just I had my like, driveway. That was it. We just had gravel. Yeah. So I would just like, walk around my house on it <laughs> <laughs> nice i don't know what you call that mine was a tony hawk birdhouse i would ride it like a street luge that's all right oh yeah yeah and there was this one big turn in my driveway and i would <laughs> into it and most time i'd just run off into the grass <laughs> but. that's what my first like real skateboard was was a tony hawk birdhouse only the realist gotta have it mine was spongebob Wow. That's pretty real. That's, <laughs> that's cool. What kind of skateboard did you have? I always ran blanks, blank decks. Is that a brand? No, they're blank. Yeah, but who makes them? Were they just <laughs> no. a two by four with wheels? <laughs> they're just blank <laughs> decks. They're just a paint on. I, them. Oh, right on. Yeah. <laughs> I had a buddy put trucks and wheels on a. Just a piece of wood. <laughs> <laughs> Shout out to Drayton. <laughs> of course it was Drayton. Dude, he was oh, the man. scooter kid at the skate park. <laughs> Dude, scooters are deadly. Like razor scooters? Yeah, on yeah, your ankles. Man. Like you try Dude. to pop like a 360. That's like the a, worst. <sighs> but if you have one with a wheelie bar, you know what I'm saying? No, bro. No. Why are you doing a wheelie <laughs> bar on a, on a you scooter? About you never wheels? had a razor scooter with a wheelie bar? No. I got a hand-me-down one from my cousins, and it was sick. You probably had one of those spark pads on the back, too, where you press down on, on no, the brakes no, and spark no, fly no, out no. The I bet back. you're hard to watch on a scooter. Like, you don't know how to hold on to the handlebars. What? Just like that. <laughs> <laughs> Lifting like you're on a, like a bull rope. Two hands. Two hands. Yep. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> <laughs> what kind of bike did oh, you Oh, you know what's intimidating? What? I've I've seen it at a skate park once. A pogo stick. That's intimidating. Dude, I had a pogo you stick. You can get wrecked out on a pogo stick. Oh, I got Those guys out on a pogo are stick. gnarly. Yeah. How about unicycles though? <laughs> <laughs> I've never even tried I've never, to do so no, I, haven't I never have, but my dad's like best friend, I called him Uncle Terry growing up because he's just so close. But he could ride the heck out of a unicycle. <laughs> like he'd just be coming around the shed <laughs> on his unicycle with a 12 pack or something. <laughs> well, could he juggle while he was doing it? I bet he could. Dude, people do tricks on unicycles. Yeah. That's ridiculous. Like hit, hit ramps and like stuff. Yeah. With one wheel. You got to balance in all the directions, all of them. I maybe can, it's only it's just one it's point just of balance. So, yeah, I know. think I don't think you like. You yeah, I got to balance in all of the directions. Mm. But you kind of like pedal to balance back and forth. But. I think if you just like stay into it, like either forward or backwards. Let's get you. One. Yeah, let's get you one, and we'll we'll, we'll make see. a video of we'll you see if you got to balance okay. in all of the directions. Well, I can do wheelies in a wheelchair for days. So, dude, me too. We had a wheelchair in the basement. Oh, my, me too. Uh, no, at the <laughs> no auto closure. No, you didn't. you didn't. Yeah, I it did. wasn't you there. Didn't. I did. <laughs> My auto collision class in high school, there was a basement and there was a wheelchair down there and we I'd hide and down there took it. This <laughs> oh, class. Yeah. and like I'd just sit be sitting down there for like forty five minutes in this wheelchair. Like I wish I had one right now, just so I could be holding the wheelie. Dude, I was way better at balancing in a wheelchair than you were. Mm, no. I can see it. Now we gotta get a wheelchair. Now we gotta get two. But I always feel bad like yeah. sitting in a wheelchair. Yeah. Like you probably shouldn't do it. <laughs> I had it in the back of my truck for a while. My mom got mad at me. She, I don't know if she thought I was like making fun of, <laughs> like, 
people that are in wheelchairs. I was like, no, mom, I just like to sit in it and do wheelies. <laughs> <laughs> but then I stopped sitting in wheelchairs. I think that. it's funny that you just took it from the school. <laughs> Oh, I don't know where it came from. It just ended up in the basement. It wasn't the oh, school's wheelchair. You brought it oh, to the you basement. Took it to I the didn't basement? bring it there, but our auto collision teacher was like, we cleaned out the basement, and it was like, somebody do something with this. So I was like, I'll take it. <laughs> <laughs> I want yeah. it. <laughs> yeah, so, so then it was in the back of my truck, and my mom got mad at me. Mm. Mm, Your nice. moms ever get mad at you guys for anything? I was a pretty... Perfect child, so no. Well, yeah. you had your brother as a shield, I feel like. Yeah. Once, <laughs> once he got old enough to do wrong, which was pretty young, he really set the tone. And so, like, the things I would do wrong weren't such a big problem. I'm more worried about his bigger mistakes. My mom got mad at me one time and tried to slap me, mm. and um, I blocked it. Oh, oh no. She got no, really no mad way. at me. I was like, what the heck, Mom? I was just protecting my face. <laughs> I was like, oh. <laughs> you raised a fighter. <laughs> what did you expect? Sorry, I got moved. <laughs> she got so mad at me. I told my mom it didn't, like, when she whooped me one time, I was like, it did, that didn't hurt. And then I just, she just waited till my dad got home, and he whooped me too. Austin, when he got to a certain age, where my mom would go to whoop him with a belt, like, it used to, she'd be, like, chasing him around because he'd be, like, running. And so she'd be, like, running and whooping him. Yeah. And, but then he got old enough to where it didn't hurt. And one day he just decided to be funny. And he just leans over. He's like, yeah, beat me. <laughs> How old was he? Probably too old to be getting spanked like 12 or something. <laughs> and my mom got that but so she bust out laughing. <laughs> but she was mad, so she was laughing. Just wait on your dad to get home. Oh Golly, God. do you remember getting spanked and like crying? And like uh -huh. you, they spank you so hard, it like knocks the wind out of you, and you're trying to cry, but you just can't. You're like, <laughs> I think I'm about to throw up. I'm gonna throw up. Yeah. Ah. I just remember being 16 and like. 16. <laughs> Man, one time kidding. last year. I'm just kidding. <laughs> I wet the bed again. They spanked me for it. I threw up because they spanked me. Throwing up as a kid was awful. I don't remember. I don't. Throw I don't up think I threw much. up much either. It was like my biggest fear as a kid i hated it so much i wish i threw up because i was like one not want to go to school but i never threw up like i was this baby yeah. that never threw up no. you know like you remember when kids would just like throw up in school yeah I was, blue? I was like so jealous i was like <laughs> i want that i want to go home <laughs> i would go to the bathroom and just like like if i wanted to go yeah. home and be like <laughs> and i just could never do it so i just go to the teacher i was like I threw up. <laughs> <laughs> Donnie, no, you did it. And one time I got in trouble because this girl broke her arm. Pretty sure one of our cameras just died. Anyways, Carson, one time <laughs> I got in trouble because this girl yeah. broke her arm, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. And so she didn't have to do her work I like at I all. They're like, broke arm, she can't write. Oh, yeah. So you just take the day off, Hot Rod. I was like, I wish I broke my arm. <laughs> yeah. And my teacher was like, no, you don't. And she gave me this big spell. Well, I'm pretty sure I do. I'm in trouble. I was like, why are you going to take everything so serious? <laughs> <laughs> they don't get it. No, they, they don't. They, don't, get it. they didn't get it that I got it at such a young age. Yeah, but they teachers got to deal with a lot. They, they chose to. Yeah. No man, yeah, yeah plus summer's off. But <laughs> imagine <laughs> having to deal with, like, your brother as a kid. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Just every day. His thing was mooning the teacher. He thought it was hilarious. Oh, that's rad, dude. In elementary school, he would just moon them all the <laughs> That'd time. That would be so funny. <laughs> well, Austin, do your work. Oh, yeah, how about this? <laughs> He'd just stand up and moon them. That's punk rock. And my mom was a that's lunch ballsy. lady. And one time I, I was in, like, fifth grade. Austin's, like, in third grade. I'm just I thought there. your mom's a librarian. She is now. She's oh. pretty much, like, had every job at this one elementary school. Mm. Just does whatever. She does it all. Just does it all. But yeah. So this Austin's teacher comes into the lunchroom laughing. He's like, uh, Amanda, your son won't quit mooning me. <laughs> 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 He's been doing it all week. 
What do you think went wrong? Because <laughs> one time what he got changed? in trouble, he got caught trying to poop in a urinal. <laughs> <What>? <laughs> like a stand-up urinal or like one of those that sit on the wall? But somebody took a picture of him doing it because they thought it was funny. Cause they were in middle school. So they got a picture of him like mid trying to poop in this urinal. And the picture got around. The teacher seen it. Boom. Boom. Now you go to the principal's office. Dang. I, like, you don't poop in your That brings back a memory. I remember being in preschool. And like, Dang. Preschool? Yeah, man. You don't remember preschool? I don't remember much. I remember nothing. going. I remember being young. I remember being in preschool and like I was going to the bathroom and I was peeing in the toilet. And, you know, there was a stall next to me and a kid was peeing in the toilet next to me. I remember looking, and he was pooping. <laughs> I was like, dude, you need to sit down. <laughs> I guess he wouldn't forget that. <laughs> I remember the kid's name and everything. Uh, I, was, I, I, I won't say his name. He was but. just standing up, pooping. But he was peeing. But he was, he was also, like facing the toilet, peeing. Oh and he, but he was pooping, and I was like, no. <laughs> I was like, I don't know if he was. They're just letting it out. I don't know if he just, he just did. I don't think he just. I don't think he knew what he was doing. I that ain't right. He was just using the rest. <laughs> I think he was just pushing really hard, and he didn't know the repercussions. He learned. You think that stopped him, or you think he was a repeat no, offender? I don't know. I don't know about that. I, I think keep tabs on. <laughs> Stayed away from yeah. that guy. Oh, oh man. man! I remember in second grade. The bathroom that was like in our wing in the school didn't have a door to the bathroom, and it's a tiny bathroom. And it also didn't like have to a the s- outside, like yeah, or the stall didn't the have a door. S- both in a school, yeah. There's no door to the Public bathroom, school? yeah. And then there's no, so it's like the layout of the bathroom is like you walk in, and like four feet in front of you is the sink and the mirror, like three feet to your left, and then back another two feet is the toilet. Was there at Just least the a, was there at least a stall like wall? Yeah. Okay. Uh, okay. But there's not a door. <laughs> and I remember ha- like Are I you was sure this wasn't a bar. This sounds like no, a bar. This was <laughs> Chance Elementary, Centralia, Missouri. Oh man. Oh and, man. Yeah. <laughs> Somebody, if you went to t- my elementary school and you're listening, comment and confirm. <laughs> but I remember just being terrified to use that bathroom, and then I finally used it one day, and I'm in second grade, and a fourth grader walks in and sees me and I was just mortified because it was a big kid and they saw me pooping. And you never <laughs> used the restroom again. No, I kept going. <laughs> <laughs> there was <laughs> in this bar we hung out in a lot in college is called the uh Deladiums. I think you've been there. Have you been there? D Lads? D Lads, yeah. 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 Uh the men's bathroom in D Lads doesn't like there's a st- there's a toilet that you can sit down on, but there's no door. And don't there, yeah. tell me somebody's pooping at the oh. bar. <laughs> yeah. You don't yeah. poop at the bar. My buddy, you go home. My buddy Tim, would, he's the only person I ever knew to poop in this toilet. <laughs> like, because there's like you walk in, it's a shotgun style building, and you walk to the very back, and the men's bathroom is back on the right, and. Four feet away from these toilets is a pool table. <laughs> you could be sitting down at this, at, on this toilet and like poke your head forward and like see out into the bar room. <laughs> and he's the only person I know to ever go to the I'm bathroom. picture in this right now. There is a bathroom if you if you get it in with. No, sorry, if Whoa. you get in with the bartenders, there's a bathroom downstairs that you can go use if uh. if it's like an emergency. That's the one that. I would use. Nice. Nice. But I wasn't a local, so I didn't have that privilege. Yeah. Mm. Kind of a weird topic. Right? <laughs> <laughs> Anybody else got a yeah, poop man, story? I don't have a poop story. <laughs> Last week? No. I'm <laughs> oh, wait. I, d- I don't have a poop story, but I have a number one story. This one time in kindergarten, we were. That's you remember my, kindergarten? This is why I hate oatmeal. This is exactly why I hate oatmeal. Uh-oh. We were making dinosaur oatmeal, and what? What is dinosaur, What's dinosaur, oatmeal? dinosaur oatmeal? You don't remember that animated cartoon with dinosaurs? Maybe Where's there's the a one? bunch of them. The one with the long neck. The Flintstone. Oh, like uh, Land Before Time. That one. Yeah. yeah. So it was. Th- it was a. I remember that theme of oatmeal. Okay. And uh, Littlefoot. 
yeah, and Petrie, yeah. Petrie and Ducky yep. and uh, what was the Triceratops? Spike. Yeah, and, yeah, them and Jokers. What was uh, Spike was not the Triceratops. That was Sarah. Sarah was yeah. the Triceratops. Who was Spike? Spike was the um, Stegosaurus. Yeah, Stegosaurus. Anyways, continue. Anyways, nice. this is why I hate all them too. What? But, uh, hey, man. we were making oatmeal as a class. We all had a bowl and we were making the thing, you know, mixing it up. And then I peed myself making oatmeal. Why do you hate oatmeal? Because you can't <laughs> control your blood. <laughs> <laughs> and then, uh, you know, just no. There, was no, there was no one at home, so I had to call my neighbor because I had his number for some reason. <laughs> <laughs> and <laughs> did you have a phone? No, I used the, the office. The, the office, yeah, and. Uh, he had to go to my grandma's or he had to go to my apartment and then my grandma gave him clothes and some stranger was bringing me clothes according to the office. And I was like, no, that's my neighbor. And uh, it doesn't sound a, any better for a while. I was just sitting there with my freaking clothes all wet. But eventually mm. I changed. The nurse didn't have like extra. I feel like the nurse kept extra clothes, yeah, like when, in, especially yeah. in like elementary when school. When I peed my pants, <laughs> <laughs> it wasn't my fault. I told the teacher I had to go. <laughs> and she didn't let me, so I peed my pants. I think that's what happened to me, dude. Oh my god, I remember. So I was on the playground, and um, I don't know what I did to make this girl laugh, but she—I don't know if I said something or if I fell or did something. She starts laughing and pointing at me, and she pees her pants, <laughs> <laughs> and like. I just remember watching. I was like, "Oh my gosh, <laughs> you're really going for it!" <laughs> like it was my fault. Yeah, like, I was like, "That's something that a kid would tell on another kid for." She did. Did she? she? Yeah, she told on me. Like, man, I made her pee her pants. What? I was did like, you get reprimanded? I don't think so. I think the teachers were probably smart enough to realize that I couldn't do that. Force her to pee her pants. <laughs> I hope so. Did you all get like what kind of timeouts and stuff did you guys have? We like, had to pull reasons? cards in kindergarten, but I don't remember like the consequences. We like had, if you got to red, it was a bad day. Oh yeah, day. we had like super green, green, yellow, and red. But if you got, I don't. It, it might have been if you got yellow was like fifteen minutes, and then red was thirty. You had to sit on like the sidewalk squares. You had to get your own square at recess, Shoot. and. That's hard time. It was. And that's where I learned to just be so tough. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but it was kind of irresponsible because we're like just on the sidewalk. <laughs> did y'all ever get ISS? I did once. Yeah. I did like, I yeah. think I did once. And it was the worst thing ever. <laughs> ISS yeah. is so dumb. I had it with a really weird older kid. <laughs> <laughs> there was like, there was probably like 10 kids in ISS with me. Well, I guess I had it twice, but whenever I had it in elementary school, you had to go to the middle school for it, and there was like a eighth, seventh, or eighth grader that was really weird in there with me, and I remember he like ate his potatoes with his finger, along with ketchup. Dude, you got the worst that. lunches at ISS, too. They would bring you like the worst stuff they had. I was there on Wednesday, and that, so that was chicken, <laughs> that was chicken patty day. I don't even remember what I got. I just remember I didn't want to eat it. Y'all have it in high school? Yeah, I never got it in high school. I um, never in high school. But they're like, I just remember we were sitting in these like, they were like regular school desks, but they had like cubicles around mm -hmm. them, so you couldn't talk to the guy next mm -hmm. to you. And the graffiti was unreal. Oh, yeah. <laughs> like, <laughs> it was like crazy stuff <laughs> carved into the wooden walls of this thing. I felt that's that sucked. ISS sucked. I felt. That's I where I got so tough. I do rem <laughs> I remember. So, like, the ISS room was this little bitty, like, basically a broom closet, but it was shared a wall with the art room. And I remember hearing a kid, like, just being a punk and just, like, arguing with the teacher and being obnoxious. And then, like, 20 minutes later, the kid's <laughs> in the ISS with me. <laughs> did y'all ever get suspended for real? Mm -mm. No, I no, did. No, I didn't. I got suspended one time. What for? Uh, I got a minor in possession at school. Whoa. <laughs> at school? <laughs> yeah. Far it, out. It was homecoming oh, week. yeah. And I was a senior. Mm -hmm. And I had left, like, 
four beers on the floorboard of my truck, and they had the drug dogs there. <laughs> mm-hmm. And well, I guess I, the, the drug dog didn't smell the the beers. Obviously, I guess, but they did you ask him? <laughs> they might have. No, but they found them, and then I had. I had like two shotguns in the back seat of my truck too. Yeah. Mm. And I was more worried about that. I was like, oh, they're going to think <laughs> <they're> <laughs> gonna real think bad stuff. Yeah. And I was like, but nothing really ever came in that. I got suspended for like three days. And I got two years supervised probation. Two years? Yeah. That's crazy. Dang, for a the judge. Year old? The judge did not. I don't think he liked my dad. Well, he was, like, getting ready to retire, and, like, my dad owned the bar in town, yeah. and he kind of threw the book at me. Yeah. Dang. Like, so you're, probation, like... Probation, probation? So you had to go super, see someone? I had to go check in, yeah. yeah. I had to, like... Like, from the state? I'm not drinking today. A probation officer. You had a Dang. P.O. Not a parole officer, a probation officer. Yeah. It's still a P.O. Yeah. Yeah, checks out. Still a P.O. Yeah. Yeah. She was a nice lady. If you don't nice. rein in that gambling problem, you're going to have one again. <laughs> Gambling's not illegal. Yeah, but whenever you lose everything and you start looking for other ways to make money. I don't mm-hmm. think they're going to give you a probation officer for that. No, it just involves, it ends up. You have uh, a problem, Donnie, is what he's trying to get at. Yeah. Yep. That was a reach. Yeah, it was. <laughs> that was a reach. I'm glad you're trying Donnie to make a joke out of my, uh, my uh, misfortunes. That's what we do. Yep. Anybody? <laughs> you ever had any misfortunes? Me? Yeah. I got bit by a scorpion once. Scorpion sting. Stung by a scorpion. Yeah, I, got, I tried. This he one wouldn't was a biter. <laughs> <laughs> this one was a biter. <laughs> you should have seen him. He was having it all. He was biting and stinging. He's taking chunks out of me. I tried to get stung. He wouldn't sting me. He was stuck on a sticky trap. That was here. Didn't? Mm. Trayton, your buddy, yeah, get lit up. Yeah, when he came up. here, there was one in his sock, and it lit up his pinky toe. <laughs> Dang. That was like... I commented on his picture yesterday. Nice. I said, that's the smallest yellowfin king uh, snapper right. I've ever seen. <laughs> that's right. <laughs> Anyways, continue. Any misfortunes? Me? Uh, yeah, my never-ending. Oh, yeah. That sucks. Yeah. Mine wasn't really a misfortune. It was stupidity. It was self-inflicted. What? Getting arrested at school. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's just part of being a bad boy, though. Yeah. That's I the bet. cost of doing business. Yeah. I bet people started some crazy rumors. I don't know. Ooh, that I time. know there was a lot of other people that had a lot worse stuff in their vehicles oh, yeah. that didn't get in any trouble. Man, I feel like But they, I wasn't no snitch. That's right. I didn't rat anybody out. He's so snitched. In my school, the random drug tests, I don't think they were ra- – because the kids that, like – Drug we, tests? Yeah. We in had, high school? We had to pee, yeah, if you were an athlete. Yeah, me too. Uh, what? Yeah. I think they get, like, they can get away with it because you sign, sign the code of conduct. That's but, BS. But I think the – I don't think it's random because the kids that you know are doing it never get tested, and it's all, like, the good kids – that get tested. Are they getting tested for just weed? I you think you just pee in a cup. And yeah. Then oh, I had performance to. enhancing drugs. That's what I was thinking. <laughs> no, maybe, but maybe I don't that know. too. But because uh, I would have not passed. No, yeah. I'm just kidding. <laughs> but I was, I was, I was heavy on the PED. Yeah. Yeah. I was cutting weight one time and I got called in to pee, and I hadn't drank any water. So, you <laughs> so it was just like it was just awkward. Yeah. <laughs> like I just couldn't pee. Mm-hmm. Drug tests like. Are so scary. You could never do drugs a day yeah. in your life. And you're yeah. like, I'm gonna fail. This yeah. Thing. Yeah. <laughs> my life's it, over. It, it's like walking into an airport and going through security. Yeah. You're like, I don't. I know there's no drugs in here or guns, but what if like someone accidentally puts yeah. something in here and I don't know about it? Like, yeah. What's gonna happen? Those are the thoughts that go oh, through my head. Man. Yeah, I don't. And like I get it. so scared. <laughs> 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 Tell us the story, Kevin. Fresh out, dog. No, uh, <laughs> hold on. Well, the in school detention and stuff, I got that. But we would, they would slap us with a bunch of lunch detention, like in high school. Where you got to eat by yourself? Yeah. That's 
Not even bad. That's no, kind of nice. I ate by yeah. myself I would, all year. I, I would bad. enjoy that. <laughs> yeah, Carlos always ate by himself. Seriously, yeah. but it would. Want. Why? Build up. I don't know. I just did. Did you know how many friends? No. No. <laughs> <laughs> of course I did. I know. That's why. That's why I figured. <laughs> no, I didn't have any. Friends. I didn't have any friends in high school. That's sad. Yeah. <laughs> You'll make it some one day. I know. I was trying. You know what's worse? The worst kind of detention? After school detention. Yeah. We didn't have that. Uh, I didn't. had to do a couple after school detentions. I had to do one. That was booty. Yeah. I hated that. Because then you're staying longer than you have to. Mm-hmm. And one time I had to do it during football season at middle school. Uh-oh. I got in big trouble with yeah. the football coach. Well, because you had to miss practice. And well, like that. well, not only that, but I was in detention. <laughs> 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 and it was not fun. Kevin, didn't your, like your freshman year, your principal still spanked people? Mm-hmm. Whoa. Like paddled people? Yep. Hit them with the paddle. That's far out. I can't believe that. Yeah. That's, that was elementary all the way up to freshman year, and then they quit it. They'd paddle kids. Sure. I remember elementary school did it. Did we talk about this I on the podcast? I think we did, because yeah. I oh. told y'all last time. Yeah. Where he paddled, like, the bottom of my boot. That way it'd give the echo throughout the hall, and then I had to go you back. You think he was class. doing that to everyone? Nah, because some kids would. If they, those kids were either, like, good actors. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Little crying. No, oh, no, yeah. Oh, yeah. Kids would ball. Dude, some people couldn't hold it together in middle school. I'm like, oh, come on. Like, you're, like, 7th, 8th grade, and you get pulled out into the hallway to catch a spanking, dude? Yeah. That's not humiliating. And then they make you walk right back <laughs> in there, and you're all... <laughs> I can't remember the last time I cried from pain. You know, yeah, like, I'm... being in pain does not make me want to cry yeah. anymore. Ever since last year. <laughs> <laughs> Man. Donnie makes me cry a lot, but that's it. That's verbal, though. Yeah. yeah. And I'm. T- it makes me tougher. Yeah. Yep. Doesn't seem like it. No. He's getting there, though. But, hey. Maybe one day. I'm getting there. Maybe one day. I probably would have got paddled a lot if I was, if they did that at my school. I was like a punk sometimes. Yeah, like to my some teachers. kids, it wouldn't. It obviously wouldn't do anything to. But then there's some kids you could tell they like never got whooped yeah. at home. Yeah, I wasn't bad, bad, but like there was days where I was like, I'm gonna push this guy. No, see, I never thought like that. <laughs> oh, I definitely did. Were you mean to the subs? Were you that no, kid? never, no, no. 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 I, we had this Vietnam vet that taught shop class in middle school. But he was dope. I liked him. Like, he was he was just an old, he was kind of an old man, you know, kind of, could be kind of honorary. And people would put, like, people would mess with him, like, make loud noises and, like, see if he would, like, what have crap. PTSD. That's awful. Oh, yeah. I never did stuff like, like that. Like, see, that's terrible. My, like, how do you even yeah. think that's funny? I guess I wouldn't, like, push, I would just, like, talk a lot and then just, like, not really oh, yeah. listen to him mm-hmm. if they told me to do something. And then just continue to do that. I pulled a prank. <laughs> me and my buddies pulled a prank on our teacher on April Fool's Day in sixth grade. Shout out, Miss Bags. How'd it go? Mrs. Bags. Um, it wasn't really even that bad of a prank. We were all like, there was probably like six of us staring out the window and like waiting for her to come in. And we we're like, oh, fight, fight, fight. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. And we we're like, oh, there's a fight outside. <laughs> and she like walks out like to go break it down. We're like, oh, April Fool's. And she got so mad. Really? Yeah. I, that'd be hilarious. Yeah, see, like Probably that's not even just like. mad because a bunch of little kids got, got her. her. Yeah. <laughs> got her ass. <laughs> <laughs> but like, I thought it was cute. Like, <laughs> we could be doing way worse stuff. Oh, oh yeah. For sure. Y'all could have been fighting. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> and I remember one time in kindergarten, same teacher that made me pee my pants. A girl had thrown a what? puzzle. What? A teacher made you pee your pants? Well, she didn't let me go pee. And I oh, my pants. okay. I forgot about that. But this girl had taken a puzzle piece and like thrown it like a frisbee or something, and it happened to go out the window, but it was like pouring thunderstorming. 
And this teacher made the girl walk outside by herself and go get it and come back in. Oh. I bet she felt good about that. Yeah, she wasn't very nice. No, I think middle school teachers get it the worst. In Dude, the, yeah. those, those are the worst teachers, teachers, but they also start to act the age of their students. When Sometimes. They, they'll be like, uh-uh, and you're like, you're 40. <laughs> 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 and you're like arguing me on my level right now. That is, too, looking it's back. pretty wild. Sweet. But they're just surrounded by it. That's, mm. like, All my middle day. school teachers were mean. You ever notice how, like, science teachers are, like, the meanest teachers? Dude, they are. My sixth grade science teacher, Miss Bach. Oh, she was scary. I and then in seventh grade, ooh, I can't even remember that my seventh grade science teacher's name, but she was scary. Everybody was scared of her. Everybody. She was frightening. I don't even remember why. She was just, like... Real dry and like, like if she would just snap at you mm-hmm. and mm. I can't even really give a good example. So now I look yeah. like an idiot. But it's the science teachers, man, they're scary. I always really, I think most of my science teachers were pretty cool. Maybe it's because I was really bad at science. I and, enjoyed it, <laughs> and like I, my worst grades were always in science, <laughs> and they were always like. <laughs> You need to pull yeah. your, <laughs> pull your act together. <laughs> Dude, I don't think I did math from like sixth grade. No, like I know On? I didn't. What do you mean you didn't? You do stopped it? at sixth grade. Like I just didn't. I just cheated. Yeah, uh, and there was no more math. Didn't. I remember I got to college, <laughs> dude. You can't cheat in college. I cheated. I couldn't do college. long to be I cheated there. more in college than I did. <laughs> Holy in shit. Like, I cheated a lot in college. <laughs> That's a that's a problem. You couldn't do long division, dog. I had to I had to figure it out, dude. When I got <laughs> what to do you college. mean? What the heck's long division? Like, it's dividing, like, but a lot of it. Like where you right and then you got the little house deal. Yeah. See, mm-hmm. yeah, I really I don't think I could do it. Right I guess now. I can't say much because I probably couldn't do it right now. Yeah. It would take me a second for sure. Multiplication all day. Yeah. Division. No. no square still, roots. Square roots. Yeah. Square roots yeah, is like easy. Square root hundred four yeah. over twelve. Yeah. No, big um, ones. So quarter bottle rockets. I mean, what? 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 Quarter bottle. That's how I always remembered the, a quart, bottle rocket. A quart of bottle. A quart. A quart. Of, how know. often are you handling bottle rockets? No, but like whenever I was, it's one of those things. Like somebody tells you how to remember it, and you just don't oh, forget like it. Like does. my dad was like, "There's twelve packs of bottle rockets in a quart, which makes 144." So mm. that's how I remembered. Whatever works. Nice. <laughs> That's fair. Yeah. Um. I didn't do a whole. I mean, a whole lot of math either. I did. I had to have someone take my college algebra class for me. Nice. Oh, how'd you do that? Online. Oh. Nice. I did the homework. He just took the test. Nice. My neighbor, my sophomore year of college, was my best friend's sister, who I'd grown up with too, and I paid her. Like ten or fifteen bucks to write every one of my papers in college. See, I was I was okay at writing papers. I could BS a paper. I was okay at it, but for ten or fifteen bucks, English and stuff yeah. was aside from spelling <laughs> <laughs> was my strong suit. Like I could I could write stuff. Spelling? No, I can't spell very good. Mm. Yeah, but nowadays history you don't need was good. To. History was good for me too. Yeah. Yeah. Memorization. Those were just easy. History is yeah. half entertaining though. Yeah. Depending on what you're talking about. Now science like metamorphic rocks, nim- yeah, I don't care. cumbis clouds, like stuff like that. Like do not care about the volcanoes, dude. Dude, <laughs> I know. <laughs> dude. Yeah. People would get riled up I volcano hate time. The volcanoes. Who cares? Yeah. For real? Not this I guy. made one vo- you volcano. You cared about the volcanoes? And I was over Oh, it. I bet you got jazzed about the volcanoes, didn't we you? We never did them, and I always wanted to. We never got to make Did you make volcanoes. a solar I never, system? Are you talking like the. No, we didn't even like make them or whatever, but like just talking about we them. We talked about them. Oh, yeah. yeah. That's People would get dope, jazzed. dude. Who cares? Yeah, it's lava. You probably like clouds too, don't you? Yeah, man, clouds are. You high. like the water. You said cycling. metamorphosis, and Carson got excited. Said metamorphic. Who metamorphosis? Metamorphosis. Kimbulo nimbus. Make it easy. You're just making stuff up. No, I'm not. That's it's a, a Nimbus re- three thousand. 
photosynthesis. Stop. You're really bad at this. Hey, man. <laughs> Use that on... <laughs> That's not for me. <laughs> <laughs> you are bad at a lot of stuff, huh? Yeah, like a lot of stuff. I feel guys, like we talk yeah. about our childhoods. I guess that's all we yeah. have to talk about, really, because we're only we're twenty in, something. Yeah, we're not. Like, that I can tell you about last year. Yeah, I'm like twenty one. Yeah, I didn't have a yeah. childhood. We're just a bunch of. You, you didn't have a childhood. Mm-hmm. So when did when does your memory begin? start? Yeah. Like having fun memory. Any like kind nineteen of memory. twenty. <laughs> oh. Wow. What day did it start? <laughs> Graduation. Wow, you graduated high school and you were like, I'm really in this thing. Huh? I'm like, I'm going to do what I want. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> That's, That's right. right. Yeah. Dude, I thought my I thought my life was over after high school. Really? Yeah. Why? Mm. Then you got to college and peaked there, don't you? <laughs> <laughs> well, I spent... <laughs> I did. <laughs> I spent a year before before I went to university. I spent a year at home, not doing jack all. Yeah, it was a sad year for Donald. Oh, because he had that thing. Hmm? The what alcohol, the alcohol thing? You had no, thing. that's no. not why I, I stayed at home because I wasn't. Yeah. I didn't because he was a loser. <laughs> yeah, I, oh, thought you were I didn't have any ambition. Like an alcoholic. <laughs> <You had probation. laughs> you had that alcohol thing. Uh, yeah, like, I just drank all the time. <laughs> remind me. <laughs> oh man, looking back, it wasn't that bad, but I thought it was terrible. Yeah, because you know? all your friends are like in these new places. My, you were just sitting on the couch thinking about joining the army, huh? Yeah. <laughs> well, yeah, yeah. I thought about joining the Air Force out of yeah. high school, but I was too scared. <laughs> Dude, Four years is a long time. Dude, man, he got me one day. I was telling him the other day, <laughs> we're in body shop. It's like junior year. The Navy guy gets me, and he like, hands me his pamphlet and all this stuff. And so I go home, and I'm like, hey, I think I'm going to join the Navy when I graduate. My parents are like, wrong. Yeah. <laughs> no, you're not. And I went back. I was like, hey, man, I guess I'm not joining the Navy. <laughs> <laughs> Why didn't they want you to join the Navy? I don't know. You can't swim. <laughs> you can't swim. They're you like, do look like somebody like, that Kevin, can't Kevin, you can't swim. do math and you can't swim. Stay home. Did I'll you take the ASVAP? Swim. No. Everybody in my house school took the ASVAP. Same. Really? Mm-hmm. No, we did. Well, that's the military. Did. That was like the only placement test I took in high school. I never took the ACT. I, I took the ACT, but I just, that we had to, it was during school. Yeah, and so. Was- I did. I knew I wasn't going to college. Like I went to tech school. Yeah. And I knew I w- didn't have to have it. So I just Christmas treat it. I never took it. I got a fourteen. I took it. What? You got a fourteen, dog. I Christmas treat it, dog. You just. Oh, blah, 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 that's not blah, bad blah, for blah. guessing, though. Hey. I know people that have gotten fourteens, yeah. and they were trying. Aww. Damn. Yeah. That's gotta make them feel bad. <laughs> Honestly, I got bored and I tried on the English. I'm parts. glad I never <laughs> took it because, like, I probably would have got a 14 or something. I did it the one time they make you, and I got like I don't even remember. It was the minimum to get into like any school. Yeah. Like, and so I was like, cool. Is that like a 17? Yeah, I was like, maybe 18. Yeah, I think a 17 you can get. What's the school. max on that? Like a 35 or a 36. 36. Okay, 36. Cool. My cousin got like one away. I was thinking um, about my score. I was like, yeah, oh, one of my, one of my friends I played football with, he got like a 34 or 35. I got a 33. Yeah. yeah. Seriously? I got accepted everywhere I applied. You're a nerd, dog. Yeah. Nerd. <laughs> That's crazy, though. That is crazy. Donnie's still mind blown. <laughs> Dang. I didn't even count to 33. My one buddy went to engineering school. He had like a 31. I thought that was crazy. 33. Crazy. That's but nuts. he only went to an engineering school to play baseball. Oh, I don't know. He might want to be an engineer. Did you go to S and T? Yeah. Raleigh. Yeah. Yeah. To play baseball. I never went up there and partied. I like should. for St. Pat's? No, I never did. They go nuts up there for yeah. St. Patty's Day. I never went to Mizzou either. I had a lot of friends go to Mizzou. I never went up there. Yeah, that was my stomping ground because I went to MAC. It was just too far, you know? That was Not like far. my backyard. Yeah, like three hours probably. Yeah. Uh, yeah, that's fair. That's weird that you never went one time, though. Cape Girardeau was a pretty, um, it was pretty entertaining enough to that you could stay pretty busy. Oh, I know the Donnie Daytona story you now. You don't know squad. I do. I know it all. You don't know nothing about me. Mm. You ever hang around 
Any college towns? I stayed up in the Atlanta area, but when I came back home, we went to Athens a lot. Where's Georgia? No, like what the, you mean? the college. Uh, UNG? Yeah, where the Bulldogs play. Oh, Athens. Athens. Yeah. How about them dogs? Go dogs. It gets rowdy there. Like, Who's that guy that sings 21? You ever heard that song? He's like, I go down to that college town when the Bulldogs play at home. Uh, shoot, what's his name? The wishing, wishing I was, I was 21. 21, yeah. Dang, that's a good song. It is a pretty good song. Never heard it. I don't think There's I've heard a it. Thomas Rhett song like that, and it's not that one. No. <laughs> so There's a horse get, in here. Don't get it confused. <laughs> yeah. This song is not a very popular song. It's no. kind of an underground song. I think song. I might have just heard it because you well, sing it. N- no, I don't sing it. Leroy sings it. Yeah. And DB thought Leroy wrote it for Oh, really? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> or I, something like that. Something along yeah, those lines. But it's a good song. Yeah. But I didn't really start partying until uh, like hey, I didn't party. junior year of college. I just hung around a lot of people that partied. <laughs> yeah, I didn't party till I was like seven. Dude. And then I got out of it when I was like nine. You got bored of it? Yeah. Yeah. That's what happened to me because my dad was a DJ. So I was always in that life until I was like nine ish, ten ish. So I was tired of music and loud noise. Well, I was yeah. kidding. <laughs> <laughs> I wasn't. My dad. Yeah, Donnie gets it. As a bar. I was taking shots of soda pop, and <laughs> shot glasses. <done>. Dude, <laughs> I, I had a, at the Anchor Fest, which is like the festival of my hometown, there was this stand that you could get root beer and old timing glasses. So I got like a glass whiskey bottle, like this big, and I would always fill it up with apple juice and like take shots out of it, like pour myself a shot. Uh, <laughs> oh, nice. yeah. Like John nice. Wayne. Dang uh, right. Outlaw. But you're not really like John Wayne. You're more like. What was What's it? the movie we watched with the um, saddle cleaning? Hey, no, 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 no. Oh no. yeah, no. no. We're not even gonna talk about that. Yeah, movie. I'm right. like. Well, that's who my name is. Me. Nobody. I'm nobody. Yeah. Well, <laughs> I don't get that reference. Uh, I think they've been closing. I, I this is only like the third little old sons podcast I've been on. Uh, I think they've been closing them with like jokes. Oh jokes. yeah. Damn. Oh man, I'm not funny though. Yeah, so one time my old lady wanted alligator <laughs> shoes. Oh, man. <laughs> and so I'm a buy you boy, so I go down there to go get her some. I, I got to find, I got to get an alligator mm-hmm. if I want these shoes, yep, right? Yep. And so I go down to the swamp. You're really going for it. And I, <laughs> I ride around on my dinghy. Yeah, you did. A.K.A. John Boat, A.K.A. Flat Bottom. And I'm riding around, sure enough, find an alligator. I thought it was a P-Row. A.K.A. Bank Skipper. A.K.A. P-Row. No. A.K.A. AKA. River Runner. It was A.K.A. A a with a mud little Ship. So I'm <laughs> riding around. I sure enough find an alligator, right, Donnie? Mm-hmm. And okay. what's a man to do? I dive off in there and I start wrestling this alligator, okay? Yep. Dang, no treble yeah. hook. I'm giving you all the quick version. Because, you know, for... Circumstances, I had to hand-to-hand combat this alligator. Mm-hmm. Right, and so I'm wrestling this alligator. We're death rolling in the water. I out death roll him. Right? <laughs> I out maneuver him. He can't get me. I'm too quick. All right, I'm determined to get these alligator shoes. So we're all beat up and banged up, but I'm doing better than him, obviously. And I get him drug up on the bank. I'm whooped, and everything's all said and done. I flip this boy over. There's no shoes on him. Oh, dang. <laughs> Carson, a joke. Yep. Or life advice or anything Weird. with some enthusiasm. <laughs> I don't know. Okay, Jonah. you have a joke. Yeah. What's the difference between a uh, dirty bus station and a lobster with a boob job? <laughs> Tell us. One is a crusty bus station. And another is a busty crustacean. Nice. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Good. Carlos. Carlos. I don't have a joke. But y- I can say the same one. Same one. What do you mean? Uh, the same joke I just said? But they just heard <laughs> oh, that. No, that's the one I... <laughs> that was the joke. <laughs> the one I always say, uh, what do you call an essay that's not fully Mexican? I don't know. A paragraph. 
Oh, I forgot. Yeah, That's so funny. one time my old lady wanted alligator shoes. <laughs> no. <laughs> my delivery Hear gets out. worse every time I tell it. It gets bad. <laughs> Do you have anything to say in this podcast? Tell me about the alligator shoes. Sure. <laughs> tell them to send you. Anyway. Man, life's a garden, dig it. Make Do it work for you. Yep. Hilarious. Good one. What am I going to do? Give up? No, man, that ain't me. <laughs> Got to keep on keeping on. Life's the garden. You dig it. Make it work for you. That's right. Yep. All right. That is, uh, that, that concludes. <laughs> I know, I know. Hey, that's <laughs> it. <laughs> I know, I know. Damn. Doodle Bob. That concludes this uh, episode of the Little Old Sons podcast. Stay tuned for more. Like, subscribe, or don't. But uh, we'll keep pumping them out for you. Thanks for watching, and as always, I'm Donnie Daytona, signing off.